If you work with SharePoint and have been curious about Content AI, now is the perfect time to try it without spending a dime. In this video, I'll show you how to take advantage of a limited time promotion that gives you access to some of the most powerful AI tools in SharePoint Online for free. Let's start with what is actually included. SharePoint Content AI services go far beyond basic automation. We're talking about autofilling columns based on file metadata, advanced document processing, content assembly with modern templates, document translation, image tagging, and even taxonomy tagging to better organize your content. Those features can save hours of manual work and bring consistency across your content libraries. If this is your first time hearing about those features, I actually have created a full YouTube series that walks through how each one of those content AI services works. It's over four hours of content. It's all practical, hands-on demos split across 17 videos. So you can really learn what you want quickly. You'll have the link in the description below, so definitely check it out. But let's go back to the purpose of this video. Here is the big news. Microsoft launched a limited time promotion that gives you access to those SharePoint Content AI features at no extra cost through December 2025. So you've got around four or five months to test, learn, and integrate those tools in your workflows before the promotion ends. I'll link the official Microsoft page in the description so you can read the details, but let's go take a look at it together. Okay, so once you go to the page that will be linked in the description here, you'll get to this page. Try out pay-as-you-go services for document processing. If we scroll down, we'll get the exact details of everything we get access to. So you see for autofill columns, we have 100 pages included monthly at no charge. For content assembly, we have 50 documents that we can create from smart templates. For document translation, we have 1 million characters. So that's quite a lot of documents. For e-signature, so even e-signature is included in this, we have five different e-signature requests. For image tagging, we have 2,500 images. Wow, that is quite a lot. That should be enough for your stock images library. So there's quite a lot of stuff in here. We have optical character resolution, pre-built document processing, structured document processing. By the way, if you're not sure what the difference is between pre-built document processing, structured document processing, and unstructured document processing, make sure you check out the fourth video from the series that I talked about that will really cover what the differences are. We even have taxonomy tagging for 50 documents that's using AI to automatically tag with managed metadata. So it really links in your existing efforts that you put in for managed metadata. One thing to know is that the autofill columns, the 100 pages here, is shared with unstructured document processing. So uh, I, I really recommend you use autofill columns rather than unstructured document processing, but that's maybe a topic for another video, but just so you know, the 100 pages here and here are shared. So now the question that you might have is, well, okay, cool, Vlad, I love the promo, but how do we get access? The cool thing with SharePoint Content AI is that you don't need an add-on license. All you have to do is activate pay-as-you-go billing in your Microsoft 365 tenant, and once that's done, you'll automatically get access to that set amount of usage for those Content AI services or document processing services each month for free. Just keep in mind that if you go over that monthly limit, the standard rates will apply. And if you're wondering what the standard rates are, I will also put them a link to them in the description below. And now to help you set this up properly, I have a dedicated video that walks through the best practices for enabling 
pay as you go in Microsoft 365. I'll link to that video as well, so you can deep dive after this because it's really important that you configure budgets properly, that you don't have any accidents where you uh, where maybe you uh, get overcharged or you activate it on more sites than you shouldn't. So uh, really that video covers everything, all the best practices in detail. So now I want to know, what features are you most excited to try? Personally, I think the document processing stuff, especially autofill columns and image tagging, have huge potential for saving time and improving content quality. But uh, let me know in the comments what you're planning to test first. And if you haven't activated pay as you go yet in your tenant, now is the time. This promotion ends in December 2025, and once it's gone, so is the free access. So don't miss the chance to try out those AI-powered features while they're still available at no cost. And of course, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you like the video and subscribe to the channel so you get notified about more awesome content and check out some of the videos appearing on your screen right now for more awesome AI and SharePoint content. Thank you again for watching this video and see you in the next one.